they never even had a chance of being retarded. Come on, come on now. Eight oh. times over. Get in, get in your box. Come on, come on. No, no, nobody. No bastards. Oh, you would have to have any kombucha, would you? I threw up my FRDA earlier. Sir, we do not allow that devil tea into this compound. Kombucha is a potion Satan employs to, to control mankind with microscopic beings that possess your gastrobacteria. Oh, goodness. Satan seems to be everywhere. Mm -hmm. Ancient Ukrainian gypsies worked shoulder to shoulder with the father of lies to construct a monstrosity not meant for this world. This mother, this mother of lies, this ungodly culture of yeast, bacteria, and evil. She makes clones of herself throughout the world and billions of people line up money in hand to guzzle her urine. Oh. Goodness, so it's a demon thing. And yeah, the government was telling me that it was part of this complete healthy breakfast. When the devil tea is in you, the demons are made invisible. They can see you, but you can't see them, giving them the tactical advantage. But I could see them. I saw them everywhere. It's horrible. Oh. That's what makes you special. You could no longer digest the lies. The veil dropped. And you can see the evil now. But I don't want to see them anymore. What do I do now? Oh, it's terrible! Daniel will know what to do. He's one of God's chosen apostles. He saved everyone here at the compound. Before I met Daniel, I was chin deep in the throes of lesbianism. Oh, I thought that was okay now. It's an abomination. Oh, guess not. Oh. The horned demon of the bull dyke had me clasped firmly between her legs. And I loved it. I smooched and licked Deception's love button with abandon. Oh. But then one night, when I was staggering home drunk from a gay bar, out of an alleyway, he appeared. Daniel. With powerful words of prayer, he clocked me in the head with a Bible. And I woke up tied to a motel bed. Oh, um, oh that's wonderful. He talked to me. He talked and talked and talked. Debunking lie after demon lie. They kept my tongue tethered to that moist, delicious hair pie. Oh. And then, when my defenses were down, he, he showed me, he showed me his. Oh. It was a holy tower of, of flesh and vein. Oh. The demon bull dyke tucked her, her tail between her legs and huddled away on cloven hooves. <laughs> that night, we were wed and our marriage consummated in multiple spurts of hot, sticky romance. Oh. Uh, and uh, he untied me from the motel bed and I followed his every command ever since. Huh. Um, I met my wife in college. Well, hey, Mary. It's time to feed the pre-tards their slop. <laughs> Hello, Gary. This is the Jew we've been waiting for. Hiya. Well, it's about time. I guess the main mission's coming. Now, now hold on one minute. I gotta put some slop here into the, uh... Uh, uh Mary? Yes, Gary? You, you created the pre-tards, right? Yes, I did. Huh. Oh, no! Oh, look! Oh, good Lord! They're not here! They, oh, they chewed their way through the plastic! No, that's impossible! <laughs> oh, my! Look at that! Oh, what's that? Is that oh, the free talk? Oh, no, I don't like the sound of that! Oh, oh, no! Oh, no, they can't hurt us, can they? Well, sometimes, when people let the demon back in... And when an expelled demon gets back in, oh, he ain't into subtlety much no more! Kill them. 
Oh, sorry. I, I, it's not mortal danger at all. Yeah, yeah good work. <sighs> yeah, solid effort there, buddy. Oh, God, let me just go get the, the mop here. Oh, oh. oh Daniel, the protect got out of Josh the Jewy. He saved us. Silence! Oh, but, but the Josh, Josh, he... Woman! The flaming sword of Zarya spoke to me in the shower. Flaming and hissed. It told me I'm a healer in peril. Oh, so you get your, mis your missions from a sword-like entity when you're naked. That's interesting. There's no time for this. Whoever this healer is, he's somehow tied to the Jew. Concerning the end times? Now, come on, everybody huddle around me so okay. I can mumble my Get in here, he's got a plan. Oh, oh. Gary, put that mop down. Okay. Get over here. All right, so what we're going to do is uh -huh. we're going to go get the Chevy. We're going to get the key. Uh -huh. okay. We're going to get the key. We're going to get out there now. We're going to go. Okay. Ride down that road. Drop it up. We're going to suck it up. All right, hey, let's do this on the ride down the elevator. Uh -huh. Ready? Five. Four.
That was easy. Oh, dude.